Hey guys, what's going on? King Flipper here, and welcome to another marking matchup predictions episode. Uh, as you know, every week uh, I try and drop it on a Saturday. Unfortunately, I did drop it on a Sunday last week. Uh, we try and get these marking matchups done so you guys can do some investments, make some money. Hopefully, you are making some money. As you know, guys, I am I am in the league, the prediction league, marking matchup prediction league. Everyone else who's in the league is in the description below, so do feel free to check them out and see what their predictions are as well. Who knows, you might make some more profit off that. But actually, I did actually the best, well, one of the best uh, last weekend with getting two right. So I'll take that. I'll definitely take that. But as you know, I always advise at the moment because of the way EA are being trolls and trolling most of us, we never, well, we can't seem to get more than two right at the moment. Um, EA are fiddling around a little bit. So I would advise to sell in the hype. Obviously, yes, you're going to lose. It's a gamble. Obviously, you're going to make money in the hype, but you're not going to make as much money. If one of the ones you predicted, one of the ones I predicted got right, so it's, it's one of them, ain't it? Um, obviously, I'll go from most likely to least likely. I get four predictions, and then I'll like, I predict a five one, which is a, a fifth one, which is a wild card. Um, so obviously, I'll go from um, I, I, most of you will probably know the most one I'm going to go for is Celtic Rangers. I'm not being funny. It's the biggest derby this weekend coming up, so you know it's definitely going to be in there. Um, uh, it's called the Old Firm Derby, just to let you know. Uh, Players to get Celtic, you can pick up Sinclair for 800 coins, which is nice as a 77 rate left mid. I've always in, I've, I've loved Sinclair ever when it was, since he was at Villa. Um, Sinclair's been one of my favourite players, so you know I've always enjoyed him. It was a shame he went to Celtic because I liked him at Villa, but you know he's doing well at Celtic as well. Uh, Rangers is a bit of a pain in the ass because you, you're looking at 900 coins. Buy it now for any rated player. Uh, as you know, the players are already going up in price because, I mean, everyone should know Celtic, Dar uh, Celtic Rangers is a massive derby, so you know. It's not even a. It, well, it is a derby, isn't it? But technically, yeah. uh, Requirements wise, I'm only going to go 72 rated. I don't think they're going to go massively high because Rangers. I think Rangers only have one goal player. I don't even think they have any goal players. I should have checked that. Uh, minimum two players from either team, so they might let you get away with just using two Celtic players. Uh, but I don't see how for you. And minimum six Scottish League players, so uh, that's what that's what the normal thing has been at the moment. So six six of the league, whatever the team's in. So you know, um, that's what I reckon for that one. Uh, next, we're going into the BPL. The thing with the BPL is there is a couple of derbies. Um, I'm going to go for the second biggest derby uh, in there, uh, Brighton versus Bournemouth, it's the South Coast derby. Uh, there is another derby as well, the West Ham versus uh, West Ham Tottenham game, but EA at the moment are trolling us, so I'm going to go for the slightly lower one. Um, I haven't invested too much in this one, I've just picked up a couple of players from each team. Um, the Celtic Rangers obviously is the one I picked up the most uh, for. Uh, rec uh, players, Brighton you can pick up Krull uh, for 600 coins, the goalkeeper. And Bournemouth again is Borak, the goalkeeper, as well for 600 coins. So both of them are roughly about the same price. There is a couple of other players you can pick up for 600 coins, but Krull and Borak are most common in for that price. Uh, requirements wise, 77 rated. Uh, they may go 76, but 77 rated. Minimum of 6 BPLs, again, obviously. Uh, and minimum of 90 chemistry. Uh, again, that's the most common requirements that normally come out for these type of leagues. So. Yeah, that's what I reckon number two would be. Uh, number three, we're going for a League One rivalry, uh, MK Dons versus Peterborough. Apparently, reading this up a little bit, um, it is a massive rivalry between these two teams. I have, I mean, it just says it's just a big rivalry between them. I don't exactly know what off the top of my head, but guys, if you do know, feel free to put it in the comments below. Uh, right, players, you can pick up any type of bronze players for both teams for 200 coins. So you're sorted there. I mean, you can pick up bids for 150. So I've I actually have invested quite a bit in this one um, because like it's one of these lower league ones that could be in and then they could drop it in and the players instantly go up and make you looking normally. I mean, look at the Coventry game, two and a half to five thousand coins each. You know, whatever. We'll go with that. Uh, requirements wise, uh, no, sorry. Yeah, requirements wise, one player from either team. I don't think they're going to go massive over it, so one player from either team would sound about right. Uh, minimum of four English players. Uh, they've done that for the game before, for the League 2 game. Um, and obviously, a minimum of 90 chemistry again. Um, so I reckon that one would be there. 
so I just got a feeling it might be that one. Uh, there is also another, I think League One or something like that that might be in it, but no, it's League Two in it. But I don't think about that one. Uh, next we got on the list is another derby: uh, Torino versus Genoa. Uh, this is the derby of the Northwest. There is other Calcio A derbies or rivalries in, but. I've got a feeling they might bring this one in because it's on the weekend. The other ones are in weekdays. They less likely do the weekday ones, but they still bring them in because it's EA. Uh, players to get a hold of. Uh, Torino, you can pick up for Rincon. Uh, Rincon for 600 coins as a centre mid. And Genoa, uh, for 600 coins, you can pick up Lexalt as a left mid. Um, so again, 600 coins seems to be the most roughly around the right things that they're doing. Uh, requirements wise, I'm only going to go 76 rated because of the per low uh, SBC at the moment. Uh, that's out all week, so uh, higher higher rated Italian league players are expensive, so you know. Um, obviously, I'm going to go minimum of 6 Kelsey away players, and then obviously, I'm going to go minimum 9 chemistry, as again, the most common requirements they bring out. Uh, so that's what I'm. Now, the last one is my wild card. Now, this is again another Scottish League derby. There is actually three, or is it four, Scottish League derbies. So, if if Celtic Rangers, I've invested in Celtic Rangers quite heavily, and I've invested in this one quite heavily. It's Motherwell versus Hamilton. Uh, as I said, there's two more, I think, two more derbies as well. I think I'm not being funny, guys. You've got to invest in the Scottish League because they're definitely going to pick one out of the four easily. They might pick two out of the four because there's that many derbies in it. Um, and it's, this is called the Lanarkshire Derby, and this is uh, the reason I picked this one over the other two is because it's a six-pointer, um, because they're both in the bottom half of the table. They're both, I think, roughly about the same amount of points, so they, it is really important for them. Um, the good thing is, as well, you can pick up bronze players for over, either teams with 200 coins. Uh, Requirements-wise, I'm only going to go 60 rated. I'm not going to go massively over the top with that one. Um, minimum of two players from either team again, uh, I think they can do that one quite easily, or it could be one from either team, So, uh, but I reckon I'm just going to say that one, and minimum of score, of score. here's Jeff, uh, a minimum of four Scottish team, uh, Scottish players, sorry, Scottish players, um, but guys, um, they are my requirements, I really would advise investing in Scottish league players, especially the ones that are derbies. Celtic and Rangers obviously are more expensive, but that's the highest likely one. As I said, I've invested a lot in it. Um, as I said, guys, feel free to check out the other ones as well. The Mother White Hamilton is another one I've invested in quite a bit as well, um, because you can pick up players for less than 200 coins, so I'm not going to complain of that. Uh, but yeah, they're my predictions. Um, guys, as I said before, um, feel free to let me know what you think. Uh, any of the other games that should be in it in the descriptions, I do check, I do read all my comments anyhow. Um, so yeah, thank you very much for watching. Hopefully we all make some decent profit. Um, but I've been making profit quite well, so it's not too bad. Hopefully I get more than two right. I mean, I'll take two out of four right with the way AA have been. Um, but yeah, if you enjoyed the video, obviously, like, share and subscribe. Sub I keep doing that. Why do I keep doing that? Subscribe. Yes, thank you very much. And obviously, I will see you in the next video or stream. Peace.